Ira is, uh, it's spelled A-I-R-A, and it is a company that provides access to instant information for people who are visually impaired. So we are uh, using a pair of glasses that is connected to a smartphone that we have an Ira app on the smartphone. And what you do is you basically put the glasses on your, on your face and you're able to link up with a network of live human agents that are around the country. And these agents are all trained. They all go through a really strict screening process to go through how to help direct a blind person or a visually impaired person, how to describe things. Um, and, and every visually impaired person um, who, who's an IRA explorer is what we call them, um, they have a profile that allows them to kind of illustrate how much description they like. So some people, for example, want a ton of description, really detailed information about colors and designs and everything else. Mm -hmm. And some people just really want to get from point A to point B as quickly as possible and want limited you know, descriptions. And so whenever the IRA agent picks up that call, what they see on their dashboard on the screen is the video that's coming out of the glasses. They see who the IRA Explorer is, they see their profile and all that information, but they also see things like the Google map to the, that's pinpointing the GPS location of, of the IRA Explorer. Mm -hmm. They see things like points of interest that are nearby, um, and they can even click on those points of interest to get things like menus mm -hmm. um, at a restaurant. So for example, if I was saying, hey, I wanted to go to this restaurant, they could direct me on how to get to that restaurant if I was walking, but they could also on the way read me the menu so that when I got to that restaurant I'd be able to know exactly what I wanted and, and what was available to me on that menu. So Ira launched um, this past year, what would you say is the most common uh, use case for the users? There's a lot of people who use it for reading different items, so for example sorting through mail is, is a constant frustration. Um, sure. Paper mail for me is like, <laughs> it's, it's annoying. Um, annoying but, for everybody. Yeah, more, seriously. More so. Um, but doing a lot of mail filtering, um, some people use it a little bit more extensively for a lot of, a lot of reading tasks. Um, there is a lot of navigation. I've, I've always been re uh, referred to as the airport guy because I, I do a lot of travel for my job and mm -hmm. so um, I absolutely love it in airports and that's something that we're really, um, we have a huge initiative for because we believe that IRA is something that should be available at every single airport around the, 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 the country and the world. Well, it definitely sounds like you're up to some great work. Greg, thanks so much for uh, showing us. Hey, thanks, Lucas.